Raghavanka Kannada, Raghavanka was a noted Kannada writer and a poet in the Hoysala court who flourished in the late 12th to early 13th century. Raghavanka is credited for popularizing the use of the native Shatpadi meter, hexa meter six -line verse in Kannada literature. Harish Chandra Kavya, in Shatpadi meter, is known to have been written with an interpretation unlike any other on the life of King Harish Chandra is well known and is considered one of the important classics of Kannada language. He was a nephew and protege of the noted 12th century Kannada poet Harihara. Although the Shapadi meter tradition existed in Kannada literature prior to Raghavanka, Raghavanka inspired the usage of the flexible meter for generations of poets, both Shaiva devotees of God Shiva and Vaishnava devotees of God Vishnu to come. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Epic writings. Harishchandra Kavya Siddharama Charitra Somanatha Charitra Virasvara Karita Harihara Mahatva Saraba Charitra Although Harishchandra Kavya c. 1200 or c. 1225 is Raghavanka's magnum opus, it was rejected by his guru, poet Harihara or Harisvara. In some ways, Raghavanka's writing surpasses his guru's talent, especially in describing characters in his story. Legend has it that his guru was aghast at Raghavanka Pandita, a devotee of Hindu god Shiva, for writing about ordinary mortals such as King Harishchandra instead of writing about Virashaiva saints. According to the same legend, five of Raghavanka's teeth fell off instantly for going against his guru's wishes. In order to expiate his sin, he authored five writings eulogizing Virashaiva saints, one writing for each fallen tooth, and the teeth returned one by one. According to another source, Raghavanka's guru physically abused him, punishing him for wasting his poetic talent in eulogizing a mere mortal. These five writings are the Siddharama Charitra or Siddharama Purana, a eulogy of the dynamic and compassionate 12th-century Virashiava saint Siddharama of Sanalij which brings out a larger-than-life image of the saint in a simple yet stylistic narrative, the Somanatha Charitra, a propagandist work which describes the life of Saint Somaya or Adaya of Polije, his humiliation after being lured by the charms of a Jain girl, and his achievement of successfully converting a Jain temple into a Shiva temple, the Virasvara Karita, a dramatic story of the blind wrath of a Shaiva warrior Virabhadra, the Mahatva, a eulogy of Harisvara of Hampi, and Saraba Charitra, the last two works now considered lost. <laughs> Magnum opus In the Harishchandra Kavya, Raghavanka brings out the clash of personalities with lively dialogues, between sage Vishvamitra and sage Vashishta, between Harishchandra and Vishvamitra and between Harishchandra and the unreal girls, dancing girls. Also narrated is Harishchandra's fidelity to truth against all odds and the redemption of Harishchandra after being rescued by an untouchable he had once rejected. According to Professor L. S. Sheshajiri Rao of the Sahitya Akademi, in no other language has the story of King Harish Chandra been dealt with this interpretation. The writing is original both in tradition and inspiration fully utilizing the potential of the Shatpadi meter. One piece of elegiac verse, written in the Mandanilla Ragal meter rhymed couplets, is the mourning of Chandramati over the death of her young son Lohitashva from snake bite, while gathering firewood for his Brahmin taskmaster. The poem has remained popular for centuries and is recited by Gamakis narration of story accompanied by music. <laughs> <laughs> Notes <laughs>